What kind of utter idiot makes that kind of mistake? Hey, Sidrail. Goes pretty well. How about with yourself? Not a good start. There we go. Oof. I'm sorry to hear that. I hope you get some good R and R afterwards. Heading out. Thank you for the good luck, Austin Spafford. I hope that you have a delightful evening. Oh, the first half of this run is really interesting, I think. There's a lot of routing decisions that are still kind of in flux at the start of the run. Right now I'm trying a new um, low XP route through the first half of the game that I came up with, and like so far it's it's fast, but man it's hard. I end up a level lower at every single important point in the run.
Oh yeah, the challenge definitely is uh, entertaining. Got a bunch of extra gold this time. I usually am like between 196 and 199 here. Probably can save some time overall here still, but... Nice. Yeah, the, the music, the art direction... I mean, I feel kind of like a broken record saying this because I say it about all the games that I play, but... It's real good. Anything in this room that requires three hits, it has to be that dude. That dude is worth five more experience. While I'm perfectly happy going for.
gotta trust that one. Just go under. Just gotta trust it. comfortable on my gold route. Prefer not to get deboosted the wrong way. Wish I knew why that happens sometimes. I think you might run out of frame roll. Because that's super rare, but it just happens. So I'm pretty sure you run out of frame roll as a result. like five seconds I just lost. kind of sloppy. That movement was real bad.
big fish? I did not. Okay, cool. Drop a heart. Come on, come on. No, come on. One more, please, one more. There we go. That was rough. Okay, that's real bad. Yeah, I'm in bad shape. This is bad. Two kills. There we go. Cool. Bummer, but it's fine. Yeah, curative drops in this game are super rare. So seeing one is always a... Real... It's a real joy. And then sometimes you get like five in a row when you don't need them. And sometimes you get them right when you need them. Okay, cool. Yeah, really, if anything, the, the good luck just seems to come in bursts more than anything else. No, I have no idea how the RNG is implemented. Yo, Ropan. Everybody, if you enjoy my new emotes, or any of my emotes, really, uh, you should give Ropan a follow, because he is awesome. And also the person who did my emotes.
Yeah, I'm not sure if the author mixes input. Um. My naive assumption here. Why would I go that far? My naive assumption is that uh, the RNG is seeded via system time. Since, I mean, this is a modern game. This is not a remake of a classic game or anything like that, so. So the, the author has, you know, access to modern cryptographic primitives. My assumption is that the author is making full use of them. Half a dozen fruit and you feel no shame? I mean... That's a great start. Oh, fruit by the foot, the candy thing. I've never actually had one of those. It wasn't great, but it wasn't terrible. Yo, Jeff, how's it going?
Oh man, Kusa sure was a thing tonight. Here's the thing, I don't think that you can really be ready for a match against Smite. There are only a few people that I think of, like, when I think people who I expect to be substantially better at video games than Smite, I think of, like, Proton John. Um, no, Smite's gonna kick my ass. That's what's gonna happen. I've made peace with it. I'm looking forward to, uh, congratulating him and cheering him on in the future. Yeah, powerful is a good word for Smite. He's real damn good at video games. No, I am not saying that Smite is going to smite me. That would be a, a bad pun and people would boo me for it, but he is. Go for this. Nope. It's close. Okay, cool. Later, losers. Also, something else that rhymes with mad. Cad? I am not Cad. One of my co-workers goes by Cad. Therefore, I can't be Cad.
No, he's a delight. Definitely one of my favorite people that I've ever worked with. No, I can I can definitely verify for you that he is in fact not drafting software. over this way. It's true, I didn't say anything about whether or not he's a robot. He could well be.
What do I do for a living? I work on computers. This is going to be a really nice goal. No! Oh, that was terrible. Alright, we're definitely not getting a gold here. Yeesh. I don't remember where a death warp puts me. I'm tempted to try it. some time there. Now I know. Alright, so a death warp definitely saves some time. How's it going, Zombie Infest? Thank you. 
Thank you for the good luck. We are on a very healthy pace for world record right now. bump me the correct direction. So that bug happens when you, uh, when you, uh, despawn that enemy, um, before he does his, uh, hyper beam attack. I will want a healthy amount of gold in order to buy the lightning sword a little bit later. It'll be 50,000. die, I'm happy. Hey, soldier dude. Bye, soldier dude. I hope nothing bad ever happens to you or your family. Alright, gonna level up here. I think we are, at least. the death warp. It's a bummer, but... Stop in for that.
you cannot buy other instruments. Really, just the lyre. No, ocarinas are dangerous. They're magic. Thank you very much. Uh, yes, I'm wearing a cryptography t-shirt. Yeah, pretty much. It's more or less my fault that the soldier died. What does it say below Bob? Eve and Mallory and Trent. Mazes, man. There's that. Now I do this. real close to having the gold that we need, but... Ooh, boy. was a super late split. I'm supposed to split when I... That was a bad jump.
Glad that I bought the herb, I guess.
I'm not sure it's accurate to say that this monkey is getting away with murder. I haven't seen him murder even one person yet. On yoink. Oh, Charm Court. Yeah, there's a monkey in this game. He's your adventure buddy. probably still this. This is less running. <laughs> yeah, if only that monkey was half genie also.
I was getting ready for a death warp. I'm curious what you mean. Yeah, that's the air ring's power. Is that dash? Please, thank you. So it looks like I lost time there. Um, that's entirely because of the fact that uh, my death warp was late, and it's gonna prevent me from having to do a bunch of the um, of the back and forth that I would have otherwise done in that palace. I didn't get the water. I have bad news, everyone. I just lost time like an idiot. This is like a minute and a half, two minutes that I just lost. For no good reason.
That's okay. You never want to PB by too much. I don't know how narrow the window is on making that uh, up slash, but it is very narrow. Yeah, Mister with eight months in a row. Thank you so, so much. It's true. I did just give you all two minutes extra in this speed run as a gift. That fight is all about getting down the um, the rhythm. Like, there's a definite rhythm to it. I'm having to rhythmically tap right in order to... Uh, You rhythmically tra uh, tap towards the, uh, towards Gom.
never realized that there was two of those in here. Yeah, this game is a very classic adventure game, uh, which most people now call Metroidvania, but I mean, this game is an homage to the, uh, the classic Wonder Boy games. The majority of which came out long before Metroidvania was a... Um, term, like at all. Toucan, thank you very much for the good luck. Uh, the rocket launcher, I hold world record right now, and I'm hoping to improve it with this run. Um, the last couple of fights in the game are going to be what really decides it, though. Never, ever, ever gonna get that right. Please let me menu. Terrible fight.
I might, I might do a 100% run at some point, but... Like, as a category, it has a few things, which... I find to be, uh... Less compelling. Didn't want to level up there. The purple bunny in town is somebody who's smart, is trying to explain to the human uh, first that angels exist, no, first that the, uh, the tower uh, can be raised and that it's not sunken forever. Then that angels exist. <sighs> I don't want to 
I wanted to do. It's real easy, though. Ooh, what a hair-raising tail. Thank you, Jeff. Bummer. I gotta work back, but whatever. Uh, the reason it's a bummer is because I had to go back. Media face.
Thank you for the GG's. One thirty-three. I guess my next goal is gonna have to be sub one thirty. Yeah, this is a new world record, but it's not gonna last for long. Yeah, the final boss fight is really, really fun. I wouldn't call this one fully successful. I took two unintentional deaths. I think it was two. At least one. Um, I forgot to go get water, which lost like two minutes. Yeah, just overall, this was, um, it was an okay run. Uh, definitely shows improvement over the last uh, run that I did last night. But, um, I'm not sure that I would call it a fully successful. <laughs> By your standards, it's more than successful. Fair enough. It was fun. Definitely lost some time on, uh, some parts where I shouldn't have. Um, is my rerouting the XP helping a lot? No. <laughs> no, it's making it much harder, uh, to finish runs. In fact, if I were routing this out for a marathon, I would probably reroute it so that I had level 3 for uh, for the first dungeon, level 5 for the second dungeon, level 6 for the, uh, the second boss, and so on. Just one level higher across the, across the board. When is low percent? Oh gosh, I don't... You know what? Uh, what time is it? Probably not going to do another run tonight. Uh, started a little bit late because I had a Cusa Grande match, but, um... I'm gonna, just for funsies, I'm gonna, I'm gonna see what it's like to fight, uh... To fight the downpour with iron armor. What do I think the chances are of a sub-hour run? Ooh. Um, we're gonna need glitches for that. <laughs> we're gonna need some new glitches. So far, the glitches that I've found have been, uh, Firefly Storage, that ball thing. Uh, if you notice me doing an up dash and not dropping the ball right away, um, that's Firefly Storage. And it lets me, the next time that I just swing my sword, I do, um, I do that attack as well. And it's, uh, it's a good way to, you know, just make sure that you can position it correctly. Um, on top of Firefly Storage, I found a glitch that when you're leaving a shop, if you do an up, uh, an upswing, it'll spawn you on an offset. It's like only 20 pixels, so we're talking like frames saved. But they are frames. But unless we can find something that, that really breaks the game, uh, some sort of major skip, some sort of really good glitch, um, Maybe I'll, I'll play around. I've got a couple of things that I've been thinking about. Um, so maybe I'll play around a little bit before I cut stream tonight. Yeah, no, it's true. Frames are frames. And saving them is better than losing them. It's just not. It's not enough frames to get us 30 minutes more. I think 125 is probably where strong runs are going to be before we find some good glitches. Like, average strong runs will end up hovering around 125. That feels... Feels probably doable. Maybe more like 128. It's getting to the point where... Like, this was the result of a lot of... Just... Keeping on um, resetting this big PB. Uh, but at this point, just from a routing perspective, we've got a bunch of 
of like movement optimization and stuff like that that can pull time down, but I don't I don't see I don't see 30 minutes. But four days ago, I said I didn't see 130, uh, 130x, let alone sub 130. So I'm sure something will be found. Yeah, so far all of the uh, the glitches that I've found that aren't the two that I've already listed have been soft locks. Um, if you die on the same frame that you enter a fire portal, uh, you spawn as the fire portal and you just, you go. You go forever. Um, which isn't all that useful. Uh, what else? <laughs> if you... Oh yeah, if you take a hit uh, as you kill Hinch Pig and you get knocked off screen, you just stand there like an idiot forever in the next screen. Um, which is a soft lock. I think that more so than a glitch, probably the the most likely um, optimizations that we're going to find, just uh, in general, I think that we're going to find additional damage boosts that are that are helpful. We're going to find you know minor route changes that save time. This fight was so bad this time. I think Cloudworm, yes, that is like a computer virus. Gizia, not Yakura. Different monsters. Promise. Uh, Neustra, the whole game is not on a global timer. Some things are on a global timer, some things are on a screen timer, some things are on a timer from when you spawn them in. Uh, like, the wisps leading up to the, um, the Earth Temple are on a global timer. The Big Fish is definitely on a spawn timer. And there are some other things that are just on a screen timer that I've noticed. Uh, the question mark, question mark, question mark enemy is the Evil Mouse, which I will show you. It's a really cool mini boss. It's a silhouette and not a Pokemon, so you don't know it. Yeah, I'll, I'll show off the Evil Mouse after the credits play out and then we'll do a uh, we'll do a, a low percent fight against the downpour I'm curious how bad it's gonna be hamstar 001 uh, there is not yet a hundred percent category on the leaderboard nobody's done a hundred percent routing nobody's done a hundred percent runs as soon as somebody has a hundred percent run like a vod of it I'll make the category it's just, right now, it doesn't exist. I'm looking forward to seeing the routing that people do, but... I'm more interested in any percent for now. Yo, Rugling, thank you for the GG. How's routing going? Media Magnet, thank you for the congratulations. You made it to Sky Village. You're almost there. Yeah, your route's almost done. Uh, Zombie Infest. Yes, this game came out the 19th of last month. So it's not even a month old yet. Yeah, if you want to route and run 100%, uh, free world record up for grabs. 